What's good out there guys? It's Roll Easy here and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, it's actually about the duffel bag, alright? So, I don't know if any of you guys know, but the save method for the duffel bag, uh, well, being able to save the duffel bag was actually patched. We don't get that right D-pad option, you know, anymore. So we finally have a brand new method on how to actually save the duffel bag. And I'll show you how to transfer it and save it. For those of you that don't have it yet, I'll leave a link down in the description. I have a video on actually how to get the duffel bag and that still works, okay? It still works 100%. Uh, founders of this are Mr. Squiddles 2K15 is the original founder actually, and then Super 420 added on and made it just a little bit better. All right, so their names are down in the description. Now we're gonna go ahead and get started right here. So where you see me now is I'm over at the clothing store and I'm just kind of gonna show you what's going on with the duffel bags since the nightclub DLC. So they didn't remove them. We still have all of our duffel bags, but we can't access anything in the clothing store while wearing them. Okay, so check it out. So you see, I picked an outfit with the duffel bag. If I walk up to the counter, I don't get any sort of right D-pad option. All right, nothing whatsoever. And if we don't have a right D-pad option, that means after we transfer, there's no way to save. And I'll show you right here. Um, if you put on a parachute and you take off the duffel bag, boom, all of a sudden we have a right D-pad option. So that is what we're working around for those of you that don't really know much about the duffel bag and what's been going on. So I'm going to show you right now how to actually transfer it and then how to successfully save it. And it's not too complicated. Well, it's not complicated at all, but it could be a little bit tricky if you're a little bad at parachuting. All right. But like anything else, you can get better at it. I mean, it's parachuting. It's not rocket science. So I'm sure mostly everybody will figure this out. And this works on Xbox One, PS4 and, uh, you know, and X or sorry, NPC. My bad. So go to this location. This is the mask shop. All right. Now, what you want to do is if you know how to transfer already, that's what we're going to be doing. So I want to transfer the duffel bag onto this outfit. I want the black open bag on this outfit right here. So I'm going to select an outfit that I'm already wearing that duffel bag. OK, so if I go over to the right, uh, I, I actually even named it black open duffel bag. So get a buzzard or an oppressor or anything and just fly up in the air. Once you fly up in the air, hop out and then open up your parachute. All right. Open up your parachute. And if you hold L1 and R1 or RB and LB on Xbox, then you're going to slow it down, open up your interaction menu and hover over the outfit that you actually want the duffel bag on. OK, now and make your way down to make a decent landing. Doesn't really matter. But right here in this animation, he's about to start taking it off midway through. Boom, right there. That's when you want to select the outfit that you want the bag on and there you go it transfers so the transfer still works but like i said the problem is at this point i can't actually save it so the second i change my outfit it's you know i'm gonna lose it as you can see right here i have no right d-pad option on my newly you know transferred duffel bag outfit so you need to go ahead and do that part again. So first transfer it onto the outfit you want, then get back on your oppressor or buzzard and do the same thing. And this is what we're gonna be doing right here. So open up the parachute and this is where it takes a little bit of skill. You wanna go ahead and land right at the mask door, right in front of it, close enough to be able to get the right D-pad option. And you're gonna see why. Right in between of opening or taking off the parachute and the back coming back, we're gonna get the right D-pad option. So watch, I'm gonna land over here, walk straight and look, that's a fail, that's okay. That means you landed too far, all right? So like I said, it could be a little tricky. You gotta be a little precise. I have actually found that you can crash right into the stand and you can still actually get the right D-pad option cause he'll get up and stuff. So it doesn't need to be a perfect landing like you literally, you know, going at a fast speed and then landing 10 feet in front of it and running, you know, five feet or four feet to get, you know, closer to it to get the right D-pad option. But you're going to see right here, this is my successful attempt. Definitely land as close as possible and you will be able to get it. So I'm going to go ahead and land really close over here. I even fell. I'm not going to spam it yet. Ready and go. Spam, spam, spam. That's when you spam right D-pad. And you see, you saw it there for a second, but then it, it, it disappeared. But you want to go ahead and save it anyway save the duffel bag no matter what even if you see even if you see it right here or not okay because look i saved it i still don't see it when i go to my interaction menu and select the outfit boom there it is so 100 saved so that's the thing guys you don't want to spam right d-pad too early okay if you spam right d-pad too early the bag might not come back so you want to kind of wait until the parachute is coming off and the bag is coming back and spam right d-pad at that point okay if you're still not hitting it you might need to go a little bit quicker okay 
But that's basically it. Nice short video. How to actually save the duffel bags once again. I showed you how to transfer them. If you still haven't gotten a duffel bag and you want to try, there is a method. I'll leave that link down in the description. Okay? So shout out to the founders. Shout out to everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. My name is Roll Easy. Please subscribe to the channel if you're brand new by hitting that big red button. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. Peace out.